Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to set up a timer, one of your timers to be a pulse timer based off of a water meter input. So from the main screen, hit set up run, go into timers, choose the timer you want. In this case this timer is already set up as a pulse timer, but if it wasn't you would go into timer type and just scroll through this menu until you got to pulse. To change these settings, you're going to go into Setup. So now we have a couple of options. This is, I want to accumulate how many gallons. And in the other video, uh, I show you how to program your water meter inputs to know what your uh, gallons per contact is. So if you don't, if you haven't done that yet, you might skip over and watch that video and take care of that. Uh, but so right now, you, I want to, I want to accumulate 100 gallons. That's fine. I want to run for we'll say one minute every hundred gallons and I want to look at water meter one now in the meter inputs you'll notice I can choose water meter one water meter two or water meter one plus two now you can take those inputs from both meters and feed based off of it uh, this is especially handy if you have two makeup lines the only caveat to that is each meter needs to have the same contact value so if, if both meters are both 100 gallons per contact, or both of them are 10 gallons per contact, uh, you can use this to add up the pulses. If they're two different values, it, it gets difficult because the, the unit is only seeing those pulses. Uh, but that is effectively how to set up a pulse timer on your Megatron unit. If you have any questions or get stuck, please call us at 800-743-7431 and our customer service department will be happy to help you.